OK, now what we're going to do is show some defences, some basic and very defences to some punches. Now we're going to show the defence for the left hook to the body. So again, I'm going to start here with my guard up. My opponent's going to throw the hook. All I'm going to do is I'm going to bend the body. I'm going to shorten my body, bringing the hand down into my hip. So again, here. What I don't want to do is trying to stop the hand like this. Again, I am too open. All I'm doing is keeping myself nice and tight this way, dropping down, elbow into your hip. Now we're going to show from another angle. So he throws the left hook, and I'm just going to lean into it. Come from there. Here. Later on, I can counter. OK, now we're going to go through the defence for the hook. We're going to show you what to do and what not to do. OK, it's going to be for the left hook. So my opponent is going to... I've got my hands up. He's going to throw his left hook. And I'm going to block this way. Lifting the hand nice and high. So again, he throws the hook. And I block this way. What I don't want to do, as he throws it, try and stop him like this. All he's going to do is come round and still hit me with that hook. OK? Boom. Yeah. Again, if my hands are not high as he comes in, boom, I'm hit. So my hands are nice and high. Block. Block this way. So that's the first defence. First defence for the left hook. Now, same thing from another angle. So my opponent throws the left hook, hands up, and I block right up here. Again, I'm also going to keep this hand up. I don't want to drop it like this because my opponent might just throw his other hand in. So one more time, block. OK, now we're going to do a catch and return drill. This is a good drill to drill because in, in, in the heat of a fight, it's a perfect way to counter-punch, counter-attack someone. You're waiting for that jab to come at you. What you're going to do is you're going to catch it with your rear hand. By me and catching it, all you have to do is turn your glove around and flex your bicep, make sure that you've got like a little bit of stability there to catch that punch. So Tony's going to do it really, really slow at me. I've caught it. This leaves me with a perfect opportunity to throw a jab out. This is instantaneous. There's no use going and then going because he's just going to evade me. It has to be at the same time. If you think about it as a, as a bar of music, it's not one, two, three, four, it's one. Okay, from another angle. Another common mistake is that people reach for that jab. You don't have to reach for it. All you have to do is turn your hands in, flex your bicep, and return. I've still got a valid defence. OK, now we'll do it at full speed. From another angle. OK, this is one of my favourite techniques because in the middle of your fight, you've probably got the timing down of your opponent's jabs. What you find that most people throw more jabs than anything in white-collar fighter. So once you, once you sort of know that the rhythm of these jabs that are coming your way, they're very, very easy to counter them. And also, as you're catching that jab, you can go straight down the pipe and hit the target right in the face. So it's very, very important to, to learn this drill and get used to doing it in the middle of a round.